What's going on guys? If you give me a few minutes here, I'm going to share with you one of the easier blitzes in the game. And the beauty of this is this is going to create a gap pressure that you're going to be able to use to get significant amount of pressure in Madden 22. Now, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, hit the follow button, hit the turn on the notifications. Let me uh, just or make sure that you know whenever we release new videos, because we release new videos every single day here on the YouTube channel. So make sure you turn on those notifications if you have not already. Also, if you're new to the channel or maybe you haven't even heard yet maybe you missed a couple videos i post new videos every single day and we just released a nickel triple defensive guide and i have to tell you this nickel triple defense is a ton of fun i it is so much fun to run this defense you're gonna get so much pressure it's honestly a really simple defense i love this defense as a base defense it's a great base defense because it's pretty good against the run pretty good against the pass and to be honest with you, has some of the best blitzes that I've ever seen in Madden 22. So that being said, let's dive into the video. The play comes to us out of the nickel triple, uh, and the play is Tampa 2. And this is the easiest blitz ever. All we're going to do is we're going to globally blitz our linebackers. And then we're going to take this guy, and we're going to stand right here. That's it. The blitz is set up. And what you're going to see is we are going to get B-gap pressure that or a gap pressure with our nose tack or with our defensive tackle right off of that guard. Again, all you do is you global blitz your linebackers. You stand right here, and at the snap of the ball, you are going to get some insane gap pressure at the quarterback. I absolutely love this blitz for a variety of different reasons. I think this is one of the best blitzes in Madden right now. As you can see, it's so simple to set up, and the pressure is unlike any other blitz in Madden. You're getting insane, insane gap pressure out of the nickel triple this is why i love this defense so much it gives you in my opinion the best blitzes in the entire game and the really cool part is you don't have to do anything literally you're global blitzing your linebackers and you're standing right here that's it snap the ball and as you see if you don't get b gap um you will see that occasionally like in practice mode it will pick it up occasionally that's because i don't have the unpredictable ability in but if you put the unpredictable ability on these two players right here this blitz is literally going to be unstoppable it's that good and as you see right there we are absolutely screaming through the b gap now i want to just let you know that if your opponent blocks the running back there's a good chance that they're going to pick this blitz up. As you see right here, they pick up the blitz. But the beauty of the nickel triple is that you get really, really quick disengages all across your defensive line. So you're going to be able to get significant pressure even though they block the running back. Okay, let me show it to you again here. And you're going to see again, five-man rush, but you get really fast sheds, and they're blocking six people. This is my favorite blitz to start out a game in. And the reason why is because it just it gives you really fast pressure. It really does. The pressure from this is insanely good if they don't block anybody. It forces them to have to block their running back. And as you can see, we get really good pressure. Now, the other thing that I like about this, or the other thing I want to let you know, is let's say that they delay fade their tight end. If they delay fade their tight end, uh, what you're going to see here is occasionally this blitz will still come in, as you saw right there, or you'll get a really quick disengage. I find that if they delay fade the tight end, the pressure is normally good enough to keep them on their toes. You're not going to have to really do a lot more. If they're going to delay fade their tight end, honestly, I'll stick in this defense for a long time because it plays really good. You've got really good contained D on the edge. But if they start to block their running back, what I like to do from this is I will just show blitz. I'll man up the running back with that left of screen linebacker, and then I'll blitz that safety that I showed blitz with. And what you'll see is if they block the running back, oftentimes I'm either able to get the gap pressure or I'm able to get the edge pressure, as you just saw me get with the safety. So this is one of my favorite blitzes in the game for a variety of different reasons. It accomplishes a lot, and there's a ways that you can adapt this to make this absolutely insanely effective against the Gun Bunch meta offense. Thanks for watching the video. If you are sitting there and you want to get my full nickel triple package and you want to start sending some gap pressures guys i have incredible incredible gap pressures uh from this defense this defense is my favorite defense right now in the game uh, and because there's so many things you can do from a pressure perspective that most people don't even think about from the nickel triple so if you want to learn my entire nickel triple defensive ebook uh, or my nickel triple defensive guide i'm going to put a link to that in the description of this video you can get the entire defense on sale right now for uh just 15 bucks it's a one-time 
time purchase uh, of 15 bucks. And this defense absolutely screams. Again, the beauty of this defense is not just in the fact that you're going to get really good pressure, but it's also found in the fact that you're going to have really, really balanced run defense. And that's why I absolutely love this defense. Thanks for watching the video. If you want to get the guide, just head down to the description right now. Click the link that I put right there for you, and you can go get the defensive ebook for just 15 bucks.